So welcome back to more Tron Evolution. Ewan. Yeah. Are you enjoying this 3D compatible Disney game? 3D compatible? Wow. And it's also PlayStation Move compatible. Can you imagine the PlayStation Move? Can I imagine the PlayStation Move? Just in general. Can, can you even think? Clearly. Okay. Yeah. That is a weird angle to go at it from. You just wants to go straight up. Jump, Mario, jump. Drink your milk and go around the corner. Come on, man. Get your act together. We, we, we're on a schedule, and we have <laughs> things to do, and we can't have you... Other lives in here? Uh, no. Okay, Waste, just... wasting my time. Time, not lives. Yeah. Okay, wow. Being a dink. I am a dink. Do you Get... have a, a mini-map or anything? No. How do you know where to go? You just sort of go. Okay, it does have a waypoint system. Okay. Yeah, it sort of guides you, and it's like, oh, you can check your map. And it's like, why would I want to? I have to go to a separate screen to look at a map. I, I realize there's a, a URL on the back of the console, or the uh, video game package. I'm gonna see if it still exists. Spell it right. What for corrupted segments of the world? If you stand on it, you'll get hurt. Energy transfer conduit or ETC are like located through blah blah blah. You can refill your health by running across it. Okay. I guess that's cool. Oh. They just wanted me to run along it to open a door. So Prince of Persia. Wow, scanning hostile. Hey, it's uh that dude from Overwatch. Uh with the dreads and the beef block. Lucio? That guy. You can refill your energy, blah 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 blah. So uh, the link still works. Really? Disney.com slash Tron Evolution Game. And it brings you to a page with a trailer and a gallery with four images. Four images? Yep. Three links to buy it, including a PC link. So I'm gonna follow some of these links and see if they actually go to anyone. Ooh, we're gonna do a little bit of background research or not? <gasps> Warming up! Level up! You can currently buy this game on Amazon for $30 US plus shipping. How about no? For the 360. You know how much I paid for it on eBay? Five bucks. Three dollars. Three dollars? Including shipping. That is very cheap. A uh, brand new copy of Tron Evolution for the PS3 is $25 for shipping. Oops. And good luck trying to play it on Windows Live because <laughs> that doesn't exist anymore. Windows Live is gone? Yep. Really? It's been gone for a while, ever since when Windows 10 came out. Ah, good. Um, you can do some workarounds and patches to it, but like if you want to play. Follow 3, which is Windows Live only. Good luck. Oh, that's sad. Yep. Because there's a whole bunch of, like, stupid background things you gotta do. Just to get it to move. Because it keeps trying to contact the Windows Live server, and it doesn't exist. So it's like, you can't play this. There's no license for it. Goodbye. Oh, uh, that's stupid. Um, look at the Steam forms. It's crazy. Are people angry about that? Oh, yeah. Because I have a physical copy of it. Can't install it because it requires Windows Live. Oh. So I had to buy it for Steam and then do a workaround to get it to go. Huh. So anyway, the PC version is $11. <laughs> don't. If you want Tron Evolution, eBay. You don't want Tron Evolution. Come on, guys. It doesn't look good. It looks incredibly generic, like it's an unfinished game almost. It feels like it. Because you have the same... NPC coming up here all the time. Sometimes they have girl hair. It's Lucio. And, and other Lucio. It's female one and female two. It's <laughs> not what I meant. Alright, uh, so I'm not gonna go there. So, yeah. 7.3 out of 10 on IMDb. Between 278 reviewers. 
278. Disney, how many reviewers do you hire? 200. 78. <laughs> to get 700. Do you remember when 6 used to be a good score? Where it's like, hey, it's not a bad game, it's just, you know, you have to like that genre? I've heard that anything lower than 8 is a 0. Yeah. Yeah. Where it used to be, oh, 6, that's not bad, it's just, you know, you have to be into that sort of game. Whereas now it's, oh, anything below an 8, just throw it in the garbage. What bothers me is not only are people going away from, like, the star systems, they're getting away from thumbs up, thumbs down. It's thumbs up only. Oh. Yeah, so, like, everything's gonna be, like, a Facebook post now. That's no good. Yeah. I don't enjoy that. So system. imagine YouTube videos doing that. Because currently, thumbs down still means an interaction. Yeah. Which gives you nothing but, you know, more wank points. Oh, wank points. Yeah. Or, uh. Yeah. Like you're. Uh, yeah, I'm not gonna go there either. But it's like interaction. So any interaction is good, whether it's vote up or down. Really? Yeah. Huh. So as long as somebody pays attention, yep. it's all good. Yep. Uh, you need so much to upgrade anything. What the fuck? No, I don't want to. I'll just go through vanilla. Can you not like vacuum up any of that stuff? Nope. Clean it off or? Nope, you just have to avoid it. Or use your mop and bucket so you can throw it to the incinerator. We ain't playing no cleaning simulators. Not even like house sim or uh, viscera cleanup detail. I would love to play some viscera. So if you'd like to see us play viscera cleanup detail, contact me on Twitter, and I will hand out a PayPal link so you can afford a computer that can play it. How does that sound? Because <laughs> oh good luck God. trying to play it on that laptop you have. Yeah, <laughs> I'm still looking for a PC. I really want to get back into animation and all that. Yeah, well. But it's hard to, like, you have to get a really good quality computer if you want to be able to render anything. You just want to make Overwatch porn, just admit it. I mean, you can make a lot of money off of that shit. <laughs> you can make a lot of porn! You can make so much porn, holy crap! <laughs> Did you read the Kotaku article that was just the other day? Uh, no. And that's what it was on? Really? And they had the Not Safe for Work links on the article? Jesus. Yeah. Just straight up clickbait, just like free porn. Okay, here oh, you go. Here you go, here's some porn. Yep. Enjoy. Take a little taste of this. I don't remember the content of the article, but that was what I took away from it. But I mean, like. Free porn. The most uh, successful furry artists will make like several hundred grand a month. Yeah, but they're all douchebags. Don't go to that art. No. Also, it. No, I'm not gonna go to <laughs> Don't want to piss anybody off. No, there's lots of angry people on the internet, and I don't want to be one of them. Everybody's so angry about everything. But if you want to yell at me, I also have a Discord. Ask me for it. Ask me so I can get yelled at. I used to put the link on the Discord into the description of the YouTube videos. Really? But we kept getting spam bots. Oh. Uh... So if you'd like, ask me on Twitter. Either West Ninja or Fish Like Studios Twitter. We also have a Facebook page, which is publicly available. Facebook actually has like algorithms that like weed people out for me. It's pretty great. Our Tumblr is still active. Tumblr has become so dead. Yeah, it's a ghost town. Like, what's left? Just blogs? I don't know. Um, I've removed everything that I've, has been blocked. So now I have nine blogs that I can't find because they don't show up on my list. Oh. So they've been set to privates for some reason. So I have nothing on my feed now. That is sad. Yeah. Tumblr used to be a place where you could just sort of find what you want to... Find art, find new music, find memes, you know, browse. Yeah. But now there's nothing. Everyone's moved on to Instagram, Twitter. I have I a certain understand. disdain for Instagram. I don't find the appeal of it. I don't like how it requires you to actually put like a picture or video. You can't do text posts. Text would be nice, but people find workarounds where they just post a picture of text. 
just like people do that on Twitter when there's too many uh, characters. Uh, ooh, a blank picture. Just like a one pixel GIF or something. Yeah. Like 12 bytes. Or you could just get a picture that is your text. But that requires having like a thing. Yeah. Just having like a standard GIF that you can just use for fucking Yeah, it would. Just like the Metal Gear Solid exclamation point. <laughs> I wish I could make that uh, sound with my mouth, but I cannot. Please don't. <laughs> I had this uh, a ringtone for my iPad for a while. Yeah, I remember that. It's such a pleasant sound to hear. Oh, Except isn't it? In game. When you set it to an alarm or something and it goes off, you're like, What was that noise? Whose footprints are these? Huh? Metal Gear. <laughs> Otacon, we need to save the Dark Chief. Where'd you get the name Otacon? Oh, from Otaku Convention! Really? Yeah, Take that is the lore reason. I hate it. It's funny. I have gripes about the Metal Gear Solid story. The writing is terrible. Yeah. So the gameplay is fine. The graphics well, are I'm great. pretty sure he wanted to end it after Metal, Ge Metal Gear Solid, the first one. That was when he wanted to end it, but... Uh... If you played Metal Gear Solid 2 and thought, hey, this story is pretty good, you're brain damaged. Solid 2 was supposed to be like, oh, you are Raiden, even what? though you hate Raiden. What world has all your bosses and generals have superpowers, yet all those standard civilians have nothing? Sometimes not even guns. Uh, guns and the Patriots had this weird thing where some of the characters were very fan y like the uh, Beauty and the Beasts or whatever. Weird. Because they were supermodels, but they were also like genetically modified to have weird, crazy abilities and their bosses and stuff. So it's like Zoolander meets X Men. Sort of. Cool. Like. That sounds like a dumb idea, and I hate it. Have you ever played it? <laughs> no, I have Guns not. Guns of the Patriots is for the PS3. The last one I played was uh, Snake Eater for the PS2. Ooh, that. And that was pretty that's great. That's the pinnacle. Up until you're like doing a, a ladder climb up down this tower and it starts singing to you. I had I stopped and climbed back up the ladder to see if what was singing. That not realizing climb, that was the soundtrack. That ladder climb is very symbolic. The entire reason there is that ladder climb is symbolism. And I enjoy that ladder climb. Okay, I, I'm gonna admit something. Symbolism, whoosh, right over my head. Every time. Well... Every time. I guess it's because I, I, it of his right descent. Past me. I don't get it. It doesn't matter what it is. Movies, whatever. Uh, 007 Skyfall? I had no idea it was Earth, Wind, and Fire. Until someone pointed it out to me. I'm like, what? Because there's an entire scene where they're like, going through this... weird mobile thing, climbing up and down and doing things, and I had no idea. It just it was a cool scene to me. Huh. Yeah. Totally missed it. I don't know where I'm supposed to go. I know I'm supposed to hit a thing. But... Like, why the dude that was, you know, uh, dying of thirst in the desert actually drank the oil? The reason behind it wasn't because he was thirsty, it's because they had to kill him. So they had to, like, end that guy who couldn't be saved, because otherwise he'd come back for another movie. Yeah. So they're like, well, symbology, right? Yeah. Because that was the whatever. Until you started looking to the actual conflict where they weren't increasing the price of water by three or four dollars. They were doing it by five or six hundred percent. So it was like thirty dollars a bottle for water. Where real life ramped it up. And the movie was like, eh, the yeah, Titanic didn't really sink. Uh, so, uh, Tron, huh? Tron. <laughs> How's this? <laughs> What's it doing for you guys, yeah, huh? Uh, yell at us in the comments if you want more of Tron. So I think we might be done with this. I'm... It's, it's, it's so bland. It's not even Tony Hawk level good. Tony Hawk is skateboarding. It's all the same. I'm sorry, Tony Hawk. I'm tempted to try and get Skate, Tony Hawk Skate, but I can't find one with a working controller. Really? So if someone at home has a working controller and a copy of Tony Hawk, and would like to send it to us, and we'll play it on, you know, uh, 
maybe live if we can get our schedules together one day. Huh? Maybe. Otherwise, it'll be in the next video. Yeah. So, bye-bye. Bye. -bye. bye.